I just started today. I'm going through my purses. I found this very chic and vintage purse. My sister got me this bag for Hanukkah and I love this bag. It is my weekend bag. I'm a little bummed out because now there is a stain on this bag and I know it's my fault, but I don't want to take responsibility for it. I tried to put makeup remover on it. It only made it worse. So now I'm going to call my mom because she has the answers for everything and she will be able to help me get this stain out. Hi mom. What's shaking? I'm, I'm very behind on spring cleaning this year and I'm going through my purses and I found a lipstick stain in my purse. I don't remember where, when it happened, but I tried to take it off with some makeup remover and it did not, it did not work. And I want to know if you knew of anything to help me out. Why didn't you do an online search, Emma? Because you are the online search. Thank you, thank you. Is it a good lipstick or is it like- I don't know. This was a not a sober doing. Okay, I didn't need to know that. Thank you for sharing. I think it's easy. Probably need like some dish soap, a little hot water. Dish soap, yeah. Cotton swabs or Q-tips, but a bunch of them, not just one. How much dish soap do we think we need? Why don't you take like a little bowl or something and take like like a cap full of it and put it in, okay. and then put it in a bowl and then put a cap full of warm water in and then like mix them together. Ooh. Okay, I overflowed. All right, I mean, too much won't be a bad thing. Take a little bit, pull pull it out, you know, so it's not like touching the leather part of the back. Yeah, and, and lay it flat. Just like little swirly, circular dabs of it, a little bit at a time. And then once you see it starts to like come up, then use the other end of the Q-tip. You don't want to keep using the same one, then you're going to swirl around the lipstick mess. Okay, how long should this take? It depends on you, Emma. <laughs> I don't know how these things happen. I don't even remember that purse. I got it as a Hanukkah gift from Andrea, my sister, like 10 years ago. Oh, it's coming off, it's coming off. Hold it up a second, let me see. You can see it's starting to whoop. Oh, good, okay, that's great. So now take another Q-tip. So you're gonna go little by little until it all comes up. Look at you, I'm so proud of you. What are you having for dinner? I knew you were gonna ask that at some point and for like a couple minutes, I was thinking of like, what should I say to her? Cause I don't have the heart to say, I only have ice cream in my apartment at the moment. Okay, so what does that mean? Probably gonna have ice cream and watch Sex in the City tonight. Wait, do I need to drop off like containers of like pasta sauce? No, I'm an adult. I'm gonna do adult things and eat ice cream and watch Sex in the City and I'll probably do a face mask. You're doing adult things. How's it going? We're getting there. What's that necklace you're wearing? It looks nice. I don't know, you bought it for me. Oh, that's why I like it. We're almost there. It's now, it's now wow. The rest of the filth on your bag is a whole other issue. Well, this is how I got the bag. Andrea gave you a filthy bag as a gift? There was also some questionable photos in it. Of whom? I don't know. <laughs> you don't? Oh my God, thanks, Mom. But you need to let it dry out a little bit. Don't close it up. Open it up. Okay, Mom. Like, okay. Okay. Thank you very much. I love you. Love you too, baby. Bye. Bye. I think it went really well. I'm surprised how simple it was. I am less stressed because I know how to clean my bag because it's definitely not the last time I'm gonna have a lipstick stain. My mom and I are typically a dynamic duo, so I wasn't surprised that we worked well together. She was helpful and she knew immediately what to do, which is a gift only moms have. Not even Google can do that. Calling my mom was the smartest idea. It was one of my better life choices. The takeaway from this is you should never hesitate to call your mom. <laughs>